The lights are shining brightly tonight in New York as USA proudly presents the 126th annual Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show presented by Pedigree. And there's the Empire State Building illuminated in red, white, and blue. And we are at the world's most famous arena, Madison Square Garden, for the most prestigious event in the dog show world. Here's a look backstage in the rotunda where the champion dogs are awaiting their big moment in the ring. That's where all the action is. They come in many shapes and sizes, colors and coats. Some have been here before and others are first timers, but they all have one goal in mind, to win the best in show at Westminster and become part of this sport's history. Remember the general public is allowed backstage. They're there too, to admire man's best friend. Hello everyone, I'm Maura Driscoll and welcome to night one of the Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show on USA Network. Over the next two nights we will bring you six hours of live canine coverage from the grandest stage of all, Westminster's Green Carpet. This event has quite a rich tradition having been around for well over a century. In fact, Westminster is the second oldest continuous sporting event in the country, second only to the Kentucky Derby. There are 2,500 entrants this year. The entry process closed in less than an hour. And for the dogs that have had the most success here, the Terrier Group has won best in show at Westminster more than any other group, 42 times in all. As I said, this show features 2,500 dogs, all champions representing 159 different breeds and varieties. They begin in the breed competition. If you win the breed, you move on to the group. The winners from those seven groups move on to the best in show ring. And here's a look at the groups we'll be seeing tonight. The working group, the terrier group with 27 breeds and varieties, the toy group, and the non-sporting group. A golden retriever was developed from the flat-coated retriever and the tweed spaniel. A single breeding produced four puppies that were to leave their paw prints all over canine history. They were the foundation stock for one of the most beloved dogs in the world. The golden's drive and pace, his keen sense of smell and soft mouth and high style all reflect his generation at a sporting dog. This is golden retriever number six. I'm rooting for him, you know that because... I, 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 Listen to the crowd. So are they. You're not alone, Joe. I'm sure a lot of people out there, our viewers, are, are rooting for this dog, too. They love kids. Ah, this is a great dog. And she was actually a surrogate mother uh, for, um, for three I'm tiger right, cubs. Please. Three orphan tiger cubs, raising them to adulthood. She still is in charge of them. Her owners, Dr. Greg Hayes and his wife, Becky, train exotic animals for movies. You know, on the website poll that we had here at USA, uh, that was the winner. More people said golden, and I can see why. <laughs> the favorite dog to go.